in Europe, each country has its own system for reimbursement and pricing of new agents. And the system depends on uh, the GDP of the country, of the healthcare system, and of course of the healthcare uh, priorities. So we are not speaking of the process of market access. We are just speaking of the evaluation. How can we assess the interest value of a new agent? And uh, of course, each country has its own solution, uh, depending on its own resources. But uh, there are two main systems. The first one is based on clinical evaluation alone, especially in Germany, you compare a new agent to the existing drug and you define the added value. And then there is a discussion with the uh, pharmaceutical company to um, find the fair price. On the other hand, there are countries in which the assessment is based on health economic uh, evaluation and especially on cost utility ratio. Uh, this is usually a, a, a different a ratio between the incre incremental cost and the incremental benefits. And it's um, uh, in, in uh, euro or pound per quality. Quality is a quality adjusted life year. So it, it's a cost effectiveness ratio. And uh, in some countries there is a threshold, for instance in uh, England the threshold is a maximum 50,000 pounds per quali. And this is rather low with a very high price of new agent and some new agent are not accepted. Uh, so usually the majority of uh, other countries choose a, a less stringent threshold, which may be three GDP per capita in European country is a 100,000 euro per quality. In my country, we, we have a combination of both approaches, clinical added value plus cost effectiveness. And we discuss the prices with the pharmaceutical company. So to conclude, there are different systems which make uh, very difficult the harmonization of evaluation in Europe. There is currently a network, which is the European Network for Health Technology Assessment, and they are trying to have a joint assessment, to have a harmonized method and guidelines, and to work more with the pharmaceutical company at the European level.